The Japanese engineering contingent of the United Nations mission in South Sudan has initiated road repair work at Godele Bridge in the outskirts of Juba town. The maintenance operation will cover 35 kilometers of road and is expected to be completed in six weeks. The United Nations Mission in South Sudan Chief Engineer Scott James Hackney says that this particular road improvement project is part of 1,200 kilometers of South Sudanese roads known as main supply routes currently being renovated. This is a, a smaller section of road that the United Nations are repairing of around about 1,200 kilometers all the way up to Bentia. So this is securing our main supply route for materials, for rations and fuel of all of our camps going all the way to the north. So it's essential that this work be done well and uh, that we do it before the rain comes towards the middle of the year. So the Japanese are just starting off today with their equipment as you can see. Uh, we're laying down the murram uh, to make the road firmer so that our big convoys and trucks can get up to the north with all the supplies that we need to fulfill the mandate. Better roads, he says, will benefit local communities as they will increase their security and access to markets, healthcare and other facilities. Of course what happens is also this is a, a significant benefit to the local community as well who have improved access to markets and for medical treatment and also for security. Most parts of roads being repaired on have been completed but work is still ongoing in many locations conducted by Anmis engineering troops from various countries. We think that we're going to be around about six weeks on the road from here to Kota, depending on uh, access and also availability of Murram and of course the weather. We've already started to see a little bit of a rain, uh, which is very early, but uh, of course we'll keep them going until we possibly can. Some of the residents in Godele were positive about the potential an improved road network has in improving the transportation of goods and other services. Anmis is currently repairing roads in parts of Mundri, Rumbek and Bentu.